A third suspect has been arrested in connection with the murder case against former NFL player Aaron Hernandez. Meanwhile, authorities believe Hernandez may have been involved in a double murder last year in Boston. As Christina Hager from our Boston station WBZ reports, that year-old cold case may uncover a motive for last month's murder. A week and a half after Odin Lloyd's murder, days after the spotlight turned on former Patriots tight end Aaron Hernandez, the district attorney says investigators now have three men they've been looking for. Ernest Wallace, Carlos Ortiz, and of course, Hernandez. We have those three individuals that were in the car at that time that Odin Lloyd got into the car. Wallace, who's from Hernandez's hometown of Bristol, Connecticut, turned himself into police in South Florida, where his mother lives. He faces a charge of accessory after murder. We were um, advised that he was possibly armed and could be dangerous. Several officers approached Mr. Wallace, and as a precaution, he was taken into custody. Police found his silver Chrysler back in Connecticut, where another hometown friend, Carlos Ortiz, cried during his extradition hearing. Once in Attleboro court, though, more composed. His warrant shows he's talked with investigators about his time spent near the murder scene on the morning it happened, admitting he had a gun here June 17th. So far, a weapons charge is all he faces. At this point, I'm not expecting further charges. Hernandez, the only one charged with murder, but the district attorney leaves the door open. Each day, something new develops. No chance for any of these three men to get out on bail, at least not at this point. And that suspect in Florida, Ernest Wallace, is expected to make his way up to Massachusetts to face charges here sometime next week. For CBS This Morning, Saturday, I'm Christina Hager in North Attleboro, Massachusetts.